Hello everybody, today I'm going to be showing you how I'm going to mount this quick release gadget to this monitor arm in order to get nice overhead shots like this so I can explain cool things to you with my hands. Stay tuned. So first I do want to say that this is not my original idea. I found this on somebody else's channel and I will link the video that I found this idea in the description so I can give them credit. But um, what I will be doing is taking these blocks of wood, drilling some holes in it so then this bracket um, is able to attach to here and then I'm going to be screwing this quick release gadget onto here. I accidentally got too long of screws by a millimeter. That is why I don't work construction. I went to attach the camera to the quick release and these holes that I drilled, these top two, or the farthest ones, they were too far for the actual quick release, so then I had to move the screws. So now, we're gonna try, and hopefully it attaches. Bam! Overhead shot. So in that way, I can be down here doing things, maybe telling you sign language or whatever. But, it'll be really cool, and then all I gotta do is quick release it, and I am on the move. Quick video. Not my original idea, but it's cool. I don't know if I'm going to leave this pole here or if I'm gonna get a dedicated table for it to be on because I have to stand back here in order to work over here and this kind of gets in the way. Um, so I'm not really sure exactly how the setup's gonna go, but I can move it because this is just a clamp and I might get a new table. All right, so it's only been, you know, like 15 minutes since I've had the setup. I've already completely changed the setup because I was having a hard time with having this facing this way because I would have to stand here with my arms wrapping around the pole to explain things. So I found this little shelf that I had in the back. This way, I'll be able to have my lighting set up here. The camera will be facing down this way so then that way when I flip up my camera screen, I'm able to see what I'm seeing from over here. And then that way I can sit at this chair and work and not worry about this pole. So here, check this out. All snapped in here so you can see what I'm doing and the best part is I can tilt this up so if I want you to see me you can so the setup is evolving already and I need to get better lighting this is just a crappy light that I had so I'm excited so now the video is over <laughs> all right this is the last time I'm changing the setup I changed it again I brought it from there to over here, I thought it would be more uniform, so then that way, when I'm sitting here explaining things, it's more of like an aesthetically pleasing background instead of seeing those windows on the side. Now I'm done. I thought the video was over. It's not over. So, this is the never ending changing video station that I have going on at the moment. Uh, what I will be doing next is, I'll be giving this 
wood background and upgrade in three, two, bam. So now I can display items and show you them on a nice charcoal gray slash black background. So I am very happy with the way this new studio is working out. Uh, now I have the lighting, I have a new table. Uh, now all I have to work on is this back wall. I have another addition. This is never ending. All right, so this is what I see when I'm filming my videos. Now, so I have the camera with the microphone with a HDMI cord going to this monitor. So now instead of having to guess if my framing's right or peek around the back of my camera because the Sony A6500 does not have a flip out screen, I now have this monitor, I have these two lights and my little table. So I'm able to flip things down like this. If I want to see the table, I am able, uh, aha, now you can see, where is it? The monitor, I'm able to see while I'm sitting up instead of having to peek over on the little tiny screen on the back of the camera. So now I think this video is over. I will have more additions. I feel like Dwight building Mega Desk for any of the Office fans out there. When is enough though? Thanks for watching.